10 minutes of Avatar Frontiers of Pandora gameplay has just been leaked and I will talk you through everything you need to know about it while keeping the video as short as I possibly can. So the 10 minutes of gameplay have been screenshotted by a user on Twitter. He's a leaker and he stated Avatar Frontiers of Pandora is likely always in first person and this is the very first image that we've got from of course Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. What we can see in the image itself is that the game is indeed first person. Person, like he states in the tweet as well we can see our very first robot enemy which is of course one of these huge suits which we've seen in the very first movie and what we can see as well is that we are playing as a navi as we already know we can't play as the soldiers from the first movie what is also very noticeable here is that we're using a gun meaning yes indeed it's not just a first person game but also a first person shooter so when you first look at this image you might not think this is avatar but of course looking at the hands you know yeah this is for sure avatar we're playing as one of the navis so from the explosions in the background i do get huge far cry vibes with these realistic explosions and of course the realistic fire which is always being used in ubisoft far cry games and of course this game is also a game by ubisoft together with massive entertainment and of course under the supervision of james cameron but when it comes to development we already know that ubisoft is very far or maybe has already completed development for the title because James Cameron of course jumped on the ship way way later to polish the game itself but obviously we also know that pre-ordering Avatar Frontiers of Pandora is possible very soon he's a very creditable source which we of course got to know by leaking Assassin's Creed Mirage so now seeing this leak does this leak get you more excited about the gameplay of Avatar Frontiers of Pandora we already knew the game itself was first person of course let me know down below in the comments since I don't want this game to be another Far Cry title. I ain't gonna lie, I got huge Far Cry vibes from this particular leak. And I don't want it to be another game where you just hop into the open world. Of course, the story of the Far Cry games is most of the time just amazing. But it's a cookie cutter game there's there's loads of gameplay features and elements that just get copied and pasted from one game into the other that's going to feel very similar like it's something that you have already played just with another storyline so there's a few things here that can finally change up the gameplay loop for ubisoft sidle which is of course that we can fly in this open world from one place to the other we also know that the open world itself will have ever-changing vegetation meaning that plants will be growing trees will be growing i don't know how that will work though because of course they're not going to grow until affinity there's maybe a tree is dying out or maybe there's you know flowers growing and there's just flowers growing out there's a different color growing back things like that is definitely going to keep this world of pandora more alive than we've ever seen in previous ubisoft titles so looking at it from a positive side it does look like avatar frontiers of pandora is finally one of those ubisoft games that they're creating which can be very refreshing which can be very innovating compared to their previous titles they haven't really innovated much in the recent years they've only made their worlds bigger bigger more and more of the same thing but here they got a triple a avatar game coming out with huge creatures with flying roaming around the world so many different possibilities and i really hope that ubisoft this time around with this brand new avatar title is going to create a game that will stay in people their minds forever like a very very long time just like rockstar games is always able to do with their gta titles as well as their red dead redemption series but of course as far as we know it definitely has the potential here so make sure to like this video if you do appreciate these short to the point videos which don't waste eight to ten minutes of your time make sure to do it and also subscribe and turn on all the post notifications for the best avatar from tears of pandora and open world gaming videos right here on the channel turn on all your post notifications to do not miss out on my future videos so i got two more videos on the screen one for you to click on my name is cheese i'm out peace